I do love these little summer harvests so much easier than the big spring and autumn ones and so much colour. Just got to wait for those peppers to arrive. Very impatient about those. Anyway, got a bit of spinach, last of the carrots, uh, the overwintered carrots. These are the new season carrots. You know, you can see quite a big difference between those. Last of those, <laughs> hopefully last of those. Don't any little potatoes. And uh, we'll see how those compare with the charlottes and the estimer and everything that's coming soon. Uh, courgettes coming on nicely, French beans, last of the calabrese for a few weeks, uh, celery looking lovely, broad beans, well, probably one more harvest of those left, really starting to get some nice uh, red cabbages now, last of <laughs> the little savoys and beautiful kales and Brussels sprout leaves. I particularly like the Brussels sprout leaves. Uh, new season onions and shallots and a lovely selection there of different varieties of strawberries. These are my favourite though. Mara de Bois, absolutely gorgeous they are. And uh, day neutral or ever bearing, so they just keep on pumping out strawberries all the way through until the first frost. Uh, raspberries, I've been picking those for a while actually, but that's the first kind of pick for um, raspberries that are going to go into the freezer, but not that one. Uh, tomatoes, yeah, still lovely little tomatoes. I'm really impressed by those plants, they just keep on going. And this is their seventh week of harvest, I think, and that is a pretty good harvest. Marsh two peas. Cucumbers keep on going as well. Uh, lovely salad onions, new season salad onions. Now I've got loads of salad onions. Somebody suggested that because I've got a bit of a salad onion glut, I should dehydrate the tops because uh, they make a nice crispy sweet snack. So I'm going to give that a go. And all of the salad bases. So I'm just going to make all the salad mixes up, finish those off and I'm done. Yeah. Nice and relaxing summer, it's lovely.